Creating web pages really can be a point and click event. With some of the new templates that come with Office 97, we can create complex pages, even forms. In this topic, we'll use a template to create a feedback form for our website. Web surfers can use this form to request more information about our facilities and the Newport area. Word is already started on our computer. We'll open the new dialog box by choosing New from the File menu and select the Web Pages tab. We'll use the Web Page Wizard to walk through the creation process. Word comes with many wizards that make creating complex documents simple. We double click on it and the wizard opens offering several different types of web page templates. We can choose a columnar layout, calendar, several types of forms, even a personal home page. We'll use the feedback form for our page. When we click on it, the form previews in the background. This looks like just what we're looking for. To continue, we click on Next. We can customize our style in this step. How about festive? Well, maybe not. Outdoors sounds good. Oh, it's just perfect. It even has ivy on it. We're done with this wizard, so we'll click on Finish. Our page looks so professional, and we didn't have to do any programming. Creating that page sure went fast. Wizards are found throughout the office suite to help us create professional-looking documents like this one. All we have left to do is customize it now. We'll simply select the text and enter our own in its place. I'll select the title and type a new heading, Ivy Lodge. I'll finish up with the rest of this text while I'm at it. Well, that's it. Our feedback form is completed and we're ready to save it. When we click on a Save button, Word suggests the name of our title, Ivy Lodge, as the file name. Also, because we use the web page template, it is automatically being saved as an HTML or web document. We'll name this form Feedback and save it in our Web Stuff folder. We double click on the folder to open it and click on Save. This is the end of this topic, using a web page template. Why not take a few moments to practice creating a web page on your computer now? We have lots more to show you about using Office 97 when we come back.